Many parts of this normal, bustling port of Oakland went silent today with gates closed and piles of containers and trucks waiting to be loaded. The halt in service comes after union workers protested this morning. Our customers are expecting deliveries and we can't make those, those deliveries and it just snowballs and every day that we're shut down is like five days of catch up. The protest was prompted by clerks representing the International Longshore and Warehouse Union who say they've been working without a contract since July. While the union did not return our calls for comment, published reports suggest this work stoppage is related to a contract dispute. And the port stoppage quickly triggered other problems. Bill Abudi runs AV Trucking and explains they had to scramble to find places to put all their extra containers. This stack of containers behind me shows you how were being played as workers, the truckers, the longshoremen were caught in the crossfire of these big corporation cartels that are doing this and it just needs to stop. The halt in the supply chain shut down three of the four port terminals this morning, sending many truckers home, some without pay. I don't get paid for the day unless I deliver a load because I get paid by the load. They literally hold the economy hostage. According to the port, the domestic cargo terminal remained open and international terminals will try to reopen tonight, but the damage may already be done for frustrated truckers. They fear what happens if companies in the unions can't reach a deal soon. You guys all need to sit down together, deal out, hash it out as quickly as possible so the consumer goods is not going to be affected by the holiday season here and uh, get us back to work. In Oakland, Valina Jones, NBC Bay Area News. Valina, thank you.